What if you've got your header template and at the moment I only have like a logo which is a heading and a nav menu and I want to add a third item in. Now this container is set up to be spaced between and I'm pretty sure you know what's going to happen the minute I add in say an icon list. Maybe I want to share my Facebook and my Twitter. It's going to probably appear in the middle and everything will kind of be spaced up. But what if I don't want the icons in the middle? What if I want them to be next door to the nav menu? Well, this is where you could think about the structure now. It might be that the moment we got container, maybe if I added in two blocks, block one would be the heading and block two would be the icon list and the nav menu. But I'm going to say, can we do it without adding in any blocks? So I'll tell you what, let's just go make sure we've clicked on container. Let's go here and let's go and add on the icon list like that. And you can see what's happened in nav menus moved to the middle. Let me just move the icon list to now be in the middle like that. I'm going to get rid of the colors, number one. I'm going to clear the color out over here and I'm going to get rid of the label. By the way, if you, you did want this to go to your Twitter page, you would go down to link and you would pick external URL and put it in. Or you could use a dynamic field as well, like a, a custom field if you've got that in, which I haven't for this example. Now, its current positioning just is not great at all. I want it to be more towards the menu. So I'm going to show you the two ways. Here's the, let me just make a duplicate first. So here's way number one. Into the top section, I'm going to drop in another container. So we've got container one, which has the heading icon, this nav menu. And then we have container two that has nothing in it at the moment. I'm going to take the icon list and put that into container one and the nav menu into there as well. Let me just rearrange them properly. There we go. I'm going to go back to the section and I am now going to ensure that this is set as a horizontal row. You can see what it's doing there. Now for this container over here, it's all over the place. So let's set that up. The first thing we're going to do is make sure the direction is like that. That is now looking a whole lot better. And I can go over to this container and I can make sure it is set to the end. You can see what it's done there, okay? It's now moved everything over quite nicely. The only thing you'd have to do, obviously, is if I just give you the preview of this, is just make sure you do your margins and your padding. But that would now put everything in one line. And now we have the social sharing icons, or to your own personal ones, more towards the nav menu using two containers. But what if we didn't want to do it that way? What if we just want to keep it with one section, sorry, one container? Well, let me show you how. Let's go to the container. Currently is space between. Instead, I'm going to set this to be end. Everything goes over to the end, right? But the heading needs to be on the left-hand side. So I'm going to go to the heading. I'm going to go to style. And I'm going to go down to the width down here for the sizing. And watch this. If I do 20%, it's moved over a little bit. If I go for 50%, it's moved over a little bit more. And you're probably thinking, yeah, well, I know what you need to do. Maybe 60%, 65%. I'm going to go a bit crazy. I'm going to put in 100%. And this is where you kind of go, but surely that should be the full width. In a weird illogical way, which kind of is illogical as well. A completeness, I've added in a 15 pixel on the right for this top container here. Let's just save that. And if we now view the page, can you see there is a little bit of difference in the layout? I get that because I haven't adjusted it all properly. But now we have logo, icon list, nav menu, split up on the screen. The top one is using two containers. The bottom one is one container. Either way, we've got it looking the way we want. I am, however, going to keep the two container approach just in case I want to mix things up later on. I hope you like, subscribe, share and follow. I'll see you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, live the grind, I could change, in my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way to win it life. I never miss that fact, taking big swings, bitch, hand me the back.